We are only two games into Suburban One League play, and tonight already has the potential to be one of the biggest games of the season here from Neshaminy High School. It's the Neshaminy Skins playing host to the Pensbury Falcons on the WBCB Sports Network. Falcons other way. Corner, Hedges, a three, count it. Each of these teams leading scorers covering one another. Zidzik, a corner three, it's good. McNeely over to Kozak. McNeely wants a three and gets it. Curley pulls it over, goes to work on Mangan. Pull up shot, dumps it down to Benjamin. A strong right hand on the left side is good. No good. Charge attempt not called by Justin Hedges. More transition opportunity. McCormick lines up a three. He cashes it in. McNeely gets it to McCormick. McNeely on the drive. Right handed floater is good. McNeely beats the buzzer with a right handed floater. 30 to 22 the score. The Falcons on top. They lead by eight. Coombs with the rebound up ahead here, Zidzik. Transition opportunity for the Skins. Nate Townsend in the corner, swings it out here. Sean Curley, a clean look from three. It's good. Another opportunity for Neshaminy. Coombs swings it out to Zidzik. They'll reset. Now Coombs, he wants a corner three. Tees it up and drains it. Finally hit one after Coombs does a great job getting some boards. McNeely with a response at the other end. Swatted by Taddy. Here come the Falcons. It's McNeely ahead to McCormick. Eurostep, right hand. It's good. Zidzik inside to Benjamin. They're fronting him all night long. He gets the basket and the foul. Six foot seven Cade Benjamin, the senior forward, getting the hoop and the harm. Hedges with Coombs on him. Gets it to McNeely. He wants a three. Hoist it up and good. Pass inside to Townsend. Has it taken away. Here comes Hedges. Hedges in transition up ahead to McCormick, the lob, the finish, no good, followed by McNeely, no good. Still loose, McCormick has it. Taddy swinging it around, the three, it's Kozak, it's good. Ty Kozak from beyond the arc, and Mark Tingle takes a timeout. Townsend, the other way, transition, hop step, turn around, good. Townsend. Nate Townsend locks us up at 50 apiece. A minute and five seconds to go. The sophomore coming up big for the Skins. Curly, Hedges on him. Neshaminy, they want the last shot. Hedges. Tracking out on Curly. Curly going to work, seven seconds on the clock. Backing down Hedges, step back for the win. Off the rim, no good. Rebound by Nunzio, the put back all around the rim, no good. And we're going to overtime. Here's Coombs, he's got McNeely out on him. Coombs wants an ISO. Goes left on McNeely, blows by him, left hand off the glass and in. Amir Coombs with a nifty finish. Hedges moving left side, gives it to McNeely, penetrates, kicks it to Kozak in the corner. Kozak goes to work, left hand on the right side, off the glass and in. Out to Curley. Right hand dribble, the drive, the right handed runner kisses it off the glass for two. Final seconds in this overtime period. Here's Coombs, hedges on him. Crossover right side, back to the left. The runner on the left, denied by McCormick. Aiden McCormick sends the runner from Coombs into the stands and a loud roar from the Falcon student section. 2.9 seconds to go. It'll remain to Chamonix Ball and a timeout called on the floor. Mark Tingle wants to draw up another look for the Skins. They break the set, try to go inside to Benjamin. Ball's loose. Townsend for the win. No good, and we're going to a second overtime. Now to Mangan, picks up his dribble. Kozak in the middle, he's left all alone. A strong left-handed take, and a charge is called. What a great game tonight here in the McCaffrey's game of the night on WBCB. Mike Warren alongside Gary Ardelli for this great rivalry. McCormick, a straight on three, he buries it. Aiden McCormick makes it a one-point game, and with 29.1 seconds to go, a timeout on the floor, I believe, taken by the Pensbury Falcons. 66-65 to go, and now some pressure applied for the Neshaminy Skins on this ensuing offensive possession. Amir Coombs, second shot at the line, is good. Two-point Neshaminy lead. 20 seconds to go in the, this double overtime period. Here's McNeely. 
Zidzic on him. They give it to McCormick, two-man set. Now McNeely on the drive, strong attempt. Forces it, ball's loose. Here's Kozak, the runner. No good. McCormick, the rebound, strong take. It's good! 67-67, we're all knotted up, and we're going to triple overtime. Here's McCormick. Pump fakes, drives. The runner blocked by Benjamin. Here comes Townsend, transition opportunity for the Skins. Euro step from Townsend, right hand on the left side is good. And here comes Coombs to set up the offense for the Skins. Blows by Mangan, gets the charity stripe, a floater, it's good. Final minute of play here. Mangan wants a free throw pull up, he gets it to go. Wolchin lets it go from the corner, no good. Rebounded by Terry, out. Mangan, a three, it's good. He's been Mr. Consistent in overtime after losing uh, Sean Curley to the foul out. Here's Mangan. He's been the hot hand since coming into the game. A strong drive. Right-handed runner. Gets the shooter's touch. Teddy Mangan taking over for the Falcons. The second one is no good. Up ahead, Chris Terry throws it way ahead. He had time to get a final shot off, but no attempt from the Falcons, and that will do it. A triple overtime thriller ends with the Neshaminy Redskins victorious. The final. Neshaminy 81, Pensbury 78, and what might have been already the best game of the season here on WBCB.